We launched Fidelity Bank in October 2006, and prior to that, we're a discount house, and it had become clear that we had to move from a discount house to banking uh, because there were peculiar challenges with the discount house business. So as a discount house, we didn't have access to foreign currency, we um, couldn't do LCs, and uh, some of the banks were taking our business from us as a discount house. And we also saw that there was an opportunity in the market to create a truly world-class Ghanaian bank. And so we set out to create this um, bank called Fidelity. In only the first year, we won at the Banking Awards the best growing bank, and it was very, very significant. I think the most significant one has to be the recent one, the Bank of the Year Award at the 2016 Banking Awards. Uh, we won it for the fact that we came strong in financial performance. We also did very well as best bank trade deal of the year, and uh, also the fact that we won the best bank for best corporate social responsibility for two consecutive years in 2014 and 2015. Currently we're going to be over a thousand permanent staff and that for me is phenomenal, especially it being a, a local company. The banking industry is evolving and Fidelity is making a difference. We entered the market to introduce a new standard in banking and by and large we've made significant inroads in our vision. Seeing it grow from a small company with one branch as a bank, and currently we have 75 branches and counting, we have um, over 700 agencies. So as an organization, I've seen it grow from a small local company into this institution that we have now. The beginning was very exciting. We had to create the brand that would represent what we wanted to create, and that meant trying different colors and logos and all the rest of it and then we created the Fidelity brand with the orange colors and the and how to design everything from checkbooks and so on and so forth. Um, then we're interviewing people every day um, to recruit the best team we could get our hands on. Um, we had to literally drive around looking for premises. Um, so there's a lot of excitement in the creation of the bank. The Fidelity brand is a spirited one. The brand color is a vibrant orange, which represents zeal, youthfulness, and an inherent urge to exceed expectation. Our staff are overwhelmingly youthful, with over 65% being under the age of 40. And I believe this passion translates into the way we engage our customers at all our touch points. The brand is customer-centric, the brand is very engaging, such that everybody in the bank is a salesperson. At Fidelity over the last 10 years or so, within our consumer banking space, which covers our small, medium enterprises, individual and high net worth um, customers of the bank, we've actually grown to just under a million customers. And that also includes our unbanked population, which is a huge focus area for us. We, as Fidelity, have done well in becoming today the fourth largest bank in Ghana. We're the largest privately owned Ghanaian bank. In joining the bank as a tier four bank and evolving to become a tier one bank within 10 years is very, very significant. We see ourselves as having the responsibility to champion a number of things, like supporting the private sector Ghanaian, like supporting inclusive banking, Ghanaians who are not, do not have access to banking services, like supporting Ghanaian small and medium scale enterprises, um, championing and financing infrastructure, um, power, roads, and other things. Um, so we are very committed to developing Ghana. Um, that's socioeconomic development is very critical to us and we're, we're driving that forward. We started with Fidelity Bank when we had to do a plan we call TT2PP in Tema. It's about a 48 megawatt facility, a plant, and they help us with financing. They finance, we find another project for us through Atoll. When you're choosing a bank, the same things you need to consider. Size, because you need a bank that's able to support you and uh, your business. You need a bank with a complete range of products. And you also need a bank which has a lot of uh, branches. 
you need a bank that is uh, up to speed with technology. Service is critical and reputation. Fidelity ticked all those boxes. Quite recently, Fidelity Bank also syndicated a, a $100 million facility for us to build a 220 megawatt plant in Boom. That plant has been finished and is running right now, or is available and running as we speak today. They make you feel you are part of them. I started off as a national service person in 2007 and I got the opportunity to go learn law when I developed the interest. I joined Fidelity in 2009, first September. I joined in as a back office person. Fidelity is a fantastic place to be. It's exciting and you get the opportunity to grow like I have, straight from national service and now I'm a lawyer in the legal department. I'd say that this is a place where you can grow. This is a place you can develop. So far as you work hard, you would excel. I think in the next five years, the number of things we want to achieve were we want to consolidate our position as a top three bank in Ghana. In the next few years, you'll see our offshore bank in Kuala Lumpur in Malaysia also becoming a significant player in wealth management and private banking. Um, and then we're also looking at raising the profile of Fidelity Securities Limited, our investment banking arm. Um, those are the three main pillars on which we're building the bank.